Thank you. Thank you. I'm Dick Hashner, and this is Sunday Update with Dick Hashner. Okay, our first story of the day. Yesterday, you may have heard that a woman in Slovakia gave birth to a egg. Uh, so, after we heard this, we investigated and we found out that in, it indeed was an egg. The allegations toward, toward her is, were true. Apparently, she gave birth to a 6-pound, 10-ounce, gigantic egg. No one knows who she how she did it but local local authorities claim that it no ah, I'm I'm sorry my mistake the teleprompter is not working today so if I say stuff that's completely up there don't see what's please <clears throat> a local minister claimed that it was an act of god she has named the egg Gustav Klemenowski Hey Mike. Hey. Oh, and one other thing. Um, I'd like to apologize that we did not do a Sunday update last Sunday, because somebody named Mike decided to take the camera into a hot tub, and then dropped it in the hot tub. Yes, Mike, for shame. For shame. Going on. <clears throat> Fans of the Twilight movies and books were shocked when Stephanie Meyer released a statement saying that the character Jacob the werewolf is gay. Although the actor had nothing to say about it, all he said was, and I quote, he's gay. Uh, all the fans of Twilight were completely mad. Stephanie Meyer has, has, has gotten tons of um, hate mail, hate emails, hate phone calls, and hate pictures. So best of luck to her. Hey, uh, hey, um, hey, Steven, did I get that rat out of my, uh, no, they didn't? Okay. Okay, <clears throat> last week we told you about a, uh, we told you a story about a man who walked into a Denny's restaurant in a bear costume holding a, a grenade. Well, we have, um, uh, gotten some new information on it, and turns out the homeless man was actually holding a Easter egg. And that his name is Earl Kozak. It is believed that he was drinking and walked in the restaurant, but turns out he is a Mormon, and just so you know, Mormons can't drink. PETA refuses to believe that he was a man and still believes that he is a bear, and is suing the police who shot him. The court hasn't gotten yet, but it's coming. Okay, <clears throat> you may have heard today that Poland's president, or yesterday, that Poland's president, Leech Krakenowski, died in a plane crash. Now the big question is, who will take his place? Uh, the elections aren't in yet, but right now, the, um, well for now, the Polish government has put Leech Krakenowski, Agnaski's cat, Yashu. This is Yashu. They have put Yashu, um, Yashu. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The cat's name is Yashu, and they've put him as the president. All and although he is a cat, the citizens of Poland are happy as as hell. Teleprompters skipping up and down again. Um, <clears throat> uh, are happy. He is already giving out a yarn to the country folk. Every country folk that he has seen. And he has already dubbed Yash Yashu the Playful. I, we were going to try to get you the Polish thing of that, but uh, too many swear, swear words. So the, they didn't get the bat out yet? We can go from there. <clears throat> okay, uh, on a Saturday note today, Jim Anderson died today after 
after br breaking the world record for most eaten plastic bottles. He had consumed his 58th bottle when he began choking. No one bo 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 bothered to help him because he was in North Korea, and you know how they feel about us. Um, <clears throat> at the time. His funeral will be in North Korea at April 28th, so mark it on your calendars, and we hope to see you there. I will try to make it, but I got a bad grudge with the Koreans. Okay, this morning, we have heard news that Nancy Pelosi made a statement saying that she saw Harry Waxman. This is Harry Waxman. She saw Harry Waxman, this guy, <clears throat> uh, go, go, uh, said that, said that, said that. Okay, yeah, Harry Waxman go to a Mole Men religion cult meeting. She said, she also said, saying that she saw 85 Mole Men. But there are many questions, like, why was she following he Henry Waxman? Is Henry Waxman a Mormon man? Uh, where did they meet at? And does she have a thing for Harry Waxman? So far, neither Harry Waxman nor Nancy Pelosi have answered then. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> the Columbus Zoo has just released a statement saying that they have put their 600-pound gorilla, Bobo, on Prozac. They put him on it because he seemed sad and would not eat his food. Now, um, what the hell? I'm sorry guys, the teleprompter is malfunctioning a lot. Right now it's skipping up and down. Okay, it stopped. Um, uh, no one seems to put in factor that the zoo's food has been long over the expired date. But the workers say Boo Boo Bobo is happier than ever. I am Dick. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, well, we got one more. <clears throat> A boy in Venezuela claimed that he had superpowers today and. Um, how did he get the superpowers, they told him? Well, apparently he was bit by a radioactive ant. He said he could fly and lift cars. Now, uh, when he tried to show the people that he could fly, he jumped off a building and fell to his death. His name was, uh, Pedro Villalobos. Very sad. I am Dick Hashner, and thank you for watching. Oh.